This is the moment that every mixed martial arts athlete hopes will materialize the number one heavyweight contender making the walk for his first title fight here in the UFC. I mean, the nerves are going crazy for this man right now. He's so nervous. Has he done everything he needs to do? Has he not left any stone unturned? He says that he has prepared. He says that his body's ready. His mind's ready. He feels physically good in the spot taking on a long-rated champion. If he's gonna get this done, it's gonna take something truly special. He does not believe jitters will be a factor here tonight. He has built his career methodically to this point. We'll see if we hear the words and new by night two. Folks, here we go, undisputed UFC heavyweight championship fight, and all eyes are on the incumbent as he makes the walk here tonight, and he's enjoying every moment of it. Huge title defense beckons for him tonight. John, he loves where he stands in the sport. He loves the admiration that comes with being the baddest man on the planet. He knows he's the biggest, he's the strongest, he's the baddest, and he loves it. And he prepares as if he never wants to let that go. This man lives for being the best. This man lives to be in the spotlight. And time and time again, we see him defend this belt as if his life depended on it. Well, right, you lose this belt, it's essentially like walking back into your new life. He has no intention of suffering that fate here tonight. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. All right, now for the particulars, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger, Razor. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner, ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, the Durant. Herb Dean, our referee for this Ready. one. Good. Scheduled for five rounds if need be. Oh, nice straight left there. Wow, strong roundhouse kick there. All right, here we go. First round is underway. No denying the big reach advantage for him tonight. We'll see if he can get that jab going. Over. Look for him to surf on the outside. Use that long jab to keep his distance and only engage on his terms. Oh, no feeling out process, folks. Here we go. Edge of your seat action right out of the chute. These dudes are trading very early in this fight. This is good. Strike now. On point with that jab today. Nice shot lands downstairs. Oh, how good is this? One minute into the fight, and we got a full on brawl. These guys said that they were going to point to the center of the octagon and they were going to fight. Did I believe them? No. So right now, I am so wrong. They are doing exactly what they said. Yeah, shades of Max Holloway against Ricardo Lamas back in the day. He loaded up there on that high kick. Make the bad man stop. Back to the jab now. Oh, 
another blistering combination there, really starting to do a nice job stringing the shots together. And you can see the damage in his opponent's body, his face, his body, his legs. He's beating him up on all the targets. It's not one guy just headhunting. He is finding every opening that is presented to him. Oh, is that a big move? The body will see if he can follow up. Ooh, what a punch. Both guys appear to land there. Two minutes have gone by here, round one. Man, his sidekick is just killer. You saw it right there. He has a really good sidekick. He's so fast at doing that technique, and there is no tell when he Work, attempts man, that certain strike. Throwing that jab, no good. Oh, knee strike right to the body. Man, his counters are on point tonight. The jab is good. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Just missed with the elbow there. Not above the eye. Nice jab. Just over two minutes to go. Oh, high amplitude head kick! Big right hook coming, it's blocked. James Levels take down. Over the head to the head is true. Great technique there. Trying to go to the body here. Unable to find the target. Oh, hurt Very fast leg kick lands for him. Well, champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment, John. It may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do, eventually it will show itself. Right now it's starting to show. Oh, perfect head kick there. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. He blocked that one. Back and forth we go. All right, so now we start to see some bruising appearing on the torso and all of that courtesy of the body work of his opponent. Just the, the wherewithal to go to the body and the discipline to stay with that approach. I mean, it's just tremendous. You, you see a fighter with a high fight IQ. But what a setup. He lands a beautiful flying knee. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. 30 seconds to go in the round. Clean punch. Oh, bleeding from his cheek now. Damage done. Head kick blocked. Ten seconds now in round one. Oh. Round two is next. All right, there's the horn indicating the end of the round. You see the cut just above the eye from that round. So the cut man's got to get in here, close that thing up. You don't want it becoming an issue here into this next round. All right, we got a few clips for you, DC, of all the damage doled out in that round and his eye continuing to be the main target. I mean, he's getting hammered. He is getting hit in that spot over and over again. And because of that, his opponent has gained in confidence and he is very limited in what he can do in his approach because safety has to be first now. You ready to fight? Ready. Here we are, early round two. Next round is now underway. I thought there was pretty good back and forth action in the previous fight. Yes, it wasn't a bar fight. It wasn't two guys throwing the kitchen sink at each other. But you did see times when it came together and you saw the skill level of these two fighters. What a kick. That one landed. So there it is. Longer reach paying dividends as he counters with a punch. Oh, really making good use of his reach advantage as he lands the straight punch there. Superman punch lands! 
Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Oh, man, the blood is flowing now. I know a lot of you like that, but he has got to figure some things out defensively or this fight's going to end. He's got to move his head, John. But the problem is, now he's got the blood to deal with. He's got a sharp striker in front of him. He has got a lot of things to deal with if he wants to win this fight. But right now, the focus needs to be on the head movement so you're not getting hit in that cut. I give one, I take one. You give one, you take one. That's how this fight is being played out. Went for the inside leg kick. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. He got that leg up quick. Beautiful head kick lands. Well, you got to think he's happy with this performance here tonight. Essentially, just the way he drew it up has been a striker. It's like a fairy tale. He's doing everything he wanted to do, and his opponent isn't doing much to try and deter him and really mess with the game plan. Three minutes now to go in round two. Beautiful strike there as he continues to attack that cut. Cut man's gonna have some work to do if we get to this duel between rounds. But that's why we got the best in the business. We got the best cut men in the business, and they are going to need him right now because this cut is getting worse, and it's only gonna continue to get worse because he has got a killer in front of him. Oh, he's hurt. He's hurt away. Bad. So an opportunity goes by the boards. He had him stunned, nearly finished, and now his opponent has recovered. The cover. Now he's got to go deal with everything that he's going to bring at him. He should have got the fight finished at that time. Right hook to the head blocked. Just over two minutes to go. Well, it's been a wild fight thus far. Perhaps a contender for some bonus money at fight's end. These guys are going to have to dig deep. They're both hurt. They're both hurt. You expected it, though. You expected a close fight. You did not expect a war like this, though, where both guys, from the moment they said fight, went forward, got the... Looked like it did stun him a little bit. Well, as soon as he goes with that high guard, he pays for it to the body. You see the bruises really starting to accumulate. In the beginning of the fight, you think, I gotta protect my head at all costs. Right now, I believe that this guy has to worry about his body. Look at how red the side of his body is. It's got to change something. With conviction to the body. <laughs> Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Oh, this could be a factor. That left eye starting to close up. Big punches. Under a minute to go. Moving to his left now. All right, so a good job by him here. He continues to block these shots. Seems to see them coming a mile away. He sees them coming a mile away, and he's blocking. Here. Nice straight right lands. 20 seconds to go round two. Lands a quick jab. Final seconds here of round two. All right, that's the end of round number two. All right, so the round is over, and you see some obvious bleeding now. Looks like the cut is on the nose. Yes, it is. Cut man will try to get in there and shut it, but of course, as soon as he absorbs the strike this next round, that thing could reopen. Certainly bears watching here moving forward. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting him over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. You ready to fight? Ready. 
Here we go, third round of this championship fight. All right, so next round underway here, and you got to admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp, and it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two legitimately fresh fighters here as we hit this next round. Oh, beautiful straight right hand. Well, new round, same result as he continues to punish the body yet again, just as he did in the previous round. Oh, nice. This beautiful kick lands. Oh, big roundhouse attempt just missed. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Oh, swelling and blood. You wonder if at some point that's going to impact the breathing. Not a good situation for him here. Nice one, two there. Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Nice punch land over the top. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Oh, inside kick. Three minutes now to go in this one. Oh, the hook lands. His left eye pretty swollen at this point. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. Another powerful kick there. A lot of volume with the feet tonight for him. It's unbelievable to watch somebody make kicking the base of their fighting style. He has shown us that it's possible. Oh, nice kick. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting them up now. Oh, man, that cut is getting worse. Absolutely nasty. Beautiful shot lands to the leg. This could do it. Could be the beginning of the end here. Nice shot inside by the champion. Two minutes to go. All right, so the redness is omnipresent now. He has absorbed a whole lot of body strikes. Pretty good poker face, but I'm not sure how many more of these he wants to take. No, he doesn't. He needs to do something different. He cannot continue to get beat up like this. But it's on his opponent. It's on the guy that is landing these strikes to continue down the path until he makes you change something. Do this over and over because it seems like this is your easiest path to victory. Oh, body kick attempt here, it's no good. Oh, another one. Real quick leg kick. Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, another strike to the body. Not a lot of real estate there, but he found it. Yet again, rinse and repeat, targeting that. Both landed. Well, he is at his kickboxing best tonight. Another nice, good series of kicks by him there. I mean, the kicks are coming in bunches. Normally, it's the hands. Tonight, he's throwing kick after kick after kick. Oh, the kick landed. Oh, pinpoint strike lands there, and not going to help the swelling upstairs. I love this accuracy, this ability to get his shots to the target right away. And you see it in the swelling that is forming on his opponent's face. So 
sure the fighters head back to the stools and hopefully this fight can continue. That is a severe cut. We'll see if the cut man can do some good work here. All right, back to the stools we go and it's starting to look like a second mouth on his cheek. <laughs> yeah, it looks terrible. I mean, the guy is getting hit with big shots. One big enough to open up a nasty cut on his cheek. While it's in a better spot, it still is very difficult to deal with. Like, if he absorbs another strike on that cheek, he might actually be able to eat through that Ready, cut fight. on his cheek. Ready. I'm just saying. He's got a big mouth. <laughs> <laughs> well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. All right, here we go. The tension is palpable. Fourth round is underway. You've got a thing or two to say about these championship rounds. The fourth round is easily the hardest round in fighting. You're so used to fighting up to three. You got to get back off of that stool. And this is a real test of your will and desire to win a fight. Storyline starting to develop here. That cut really starting to gap wide open as this fight comes And you can watch him. You see him. You can see it becoming his focus as he's popping him on that cut. And it's starting to open up more and more as the fight goes longer. The right hand just misses. Well, defense doesn't necessarily win championships in MMA, but he's doing a nice job blocking these shots. He's not allowing his opponent to get any damage off on him by blocking all these attacks. Oh, nice low kick. Well, confidence is high. I repeat, confidence is high. And I got to think when you knock a fighter down in the previous round, that's going to think you can do it again. I mean, confidence is key in anything you do. In you didn't like that left hand. He got him hurt bad here. Still targeting that cut, and it is getting worse by the minute. Lands the grounded pound strike here. He's just being more aggressive, and because he's being more aggressive and more loose with his strikes, right he's landing. Beautiful setup to the leg. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. Right back on his leg kicks. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He certainly has that part of his game going tonight. He's a fantastic kickboxer, but tonight is the kicks that's leading the dance. Oh! Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing. Oh. Back to his feet. Certainly found the target. Just over two minutes to go in the round. Oh, you land, I land. Is that what we're doing here? He's got a good leg kick. There it is. Oh, and he counters effectively with a jab upstairs there, DC. I know you don't often have the reach advantage, but nice to see him making good use of it in this matchup. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Well, I can't even relate to the mental and physical toughness we are seeing from these two individuals. Both fighters damaged and compromised. Yeah, they're both in on the heart. They're both trying to really show that they belong. They're both trying to show that they're the better fighter. They have been matched at every single step. They're both bloody, battered, bruised, but neither one of them is willing to take a step back. These guys want to win. In the half guard. Inside the closed guard now. I mean, he went right into his full guard. What does he do to try to advance himself to give him more of an advantage on the mat? And he is back up to his feet. Oh, brilliant execution to land the roundhouse. Well, this fight has been absolutely crazy. Both fighters continuing to... Oh, oh my goodness. That is it. Oh, my goodness. 
I mean, you got to be kidding me with that knockout. If that is not the number one play on SportsCenter tonight, I'm not sure what would top it. One of the best knockouts we've seen all year. In a very long time. I have not seen someone look this good. He promised us something, and he delivered with that beautiful knockout. Now we go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer for the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 19 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by knockout and new undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Razor. Well, DC, you know how much I love crowning new champions yeah. and when we get to see these men and women realize these dreams. But to do it at heavyweight, man, just incredible to see this guy realize a UFC title. And you look at the emotion on his face. You can tell that this is a dream that he has had for a long time. And now it is realized. Congratulations to the champ and his entire team. And best of luck trying to defend it, oh, by the yeah, way. Oh, yeah, man. This is volatile. Look, they got a whole bunch of hungry wolves lining up to take that belt.